Good morning, everybody. It's John from Veganism Kills. It's 9.05 a.m. Wednesday, July 6th. Today, we're going to show you how veganism is a really bad idea. And it's only promoted by nimcompoops. Vegan Florida mom found guilty of starving 18-month-old to death. She's been convicted of first-degree murder. That carries a life sentence. And I'm pretty sure her partner there, right next to her, what you see in front of you, he's going to get a life sentence too. That's what veganism has done for them and their child. It cost them all their lives. Now you would think this would be an anomaly. It is not. There's another vegan couple who have been sentenced to life over baby's death because of their cultish belief in veganism. If you want to see where veganism leads you to, all you have to do is do a Google search, vegan diet destroyed my health, and you get pages of testimony. On the state of vegans' mental health, where they think it's okay to hold people hostage in the Ukraine and force people to endorse stupid vegan films made by vegan corporations who want to sell you fake meat. Here goes another vegan lunatic that went and shot up YouTube headquarters. Vegan child deaths. This is about Mick the Vegan, who splatters his rhetoric all over YouTube saying that the vegan diet is good from cradle to the grave, but has kept hidden that his own child never made it to two years old. Here's Mick's social blade account. What you'll notice about a lot of these vegans, they block you from seeing their subscribers for the last 30 days. That's because their subscriber count is going down, not up. And you can see Mixed Channel is dying also. Because when you tell everybody the diet is the healthiest diet known to man, and your own child dies while you force them on it. You might cause some self-inflicted harm, Mick. Here goes another kook. Another one that hides their subscriber count because it's going down. And you can obviously see it here. These red spikes down. He's going into negative territory on his subscribers. Because this guy has no credentials, and he doesn't know what the fuck he's talking about. He's an idiot. He's another vegan with the room temperature IQ. He'd be better off putting a piece of broccoli in that chair. it fucking make more sense than he does. Here goes Freely the Banana Girl, another one that hides her subscribers for the last 30 days. You'll see what's indicative of losing subs. Or these little patches you see where the red goes below the line. She's losing subs. Her channel is the, in decline. She's losing subs. She can't make the sale anymore. Because nobody's believing in the bullshit anymore. Now this is something called Gingy. She was a raw vegan. And she quit after she found her kids were eating ants. But that's not the worst of it. You see, Gingy made this statement. I have heard of vegan kids scavenging in garbage bins. When has that become okay, people? When is it okay for your kid to scavenge in people's garbage bins to find food? When it's the parent's responsibility to feed them a proper diet? I think a lot more of these vegans need to go to fucking jail. I think some of these people on YouTube need to go to fucking jail. They influence people to commit crimes like this. And it is a crime. Murder is a crime. Starving your child to death is a crime. And you know and you know your diet is insufficient when the CDC comes out and says so.
There is no arguing. There is no debating, you vegans. It's over. There is no debate. Carnivore and vegan has been keeping the list. I'm sorry, carnivore is vegan. It's been keeping a list of all known deaths of vegans. These motherfuckers are lucky if they make it to 55. Why is the life expectancy so low? Because the ones that live to 104 have been found to have been cheating. And plus this, this right here. Look, look at the bottom of the list. I want you to see this. List of dead vegan children. Starvation by parents. What the fuck is wrong with you vegans? What is wrong? Are we getting through? Why does it seem the only way we're going to get through to you is when you're in fucking jail? Here goes a prominent vegan guru, doctor, fake doctor, Michael Greger, answering a question, did a vegan diet kill this baby? And the answer is yes. That's from your side of the fence, vegans. And I know you hate this video. Oh, God, how they hate this video. They deny it. They say you altered it. They come up with all kinds of unique shit to the garbage vegan mind. If you're a vegan and you believe this diet is 100% healthy for all stages of life, you are a moron. You're not solving a problem, you're causing a problem. And it's obviously, this is the most heinous problem you can cause, is the death of children. And yet you still come online in the comments field, the vegan diet is the bestest. Oh, killing animals is a crime. It's murder. Meanwhile, who's going to jail for murder? Are the people speaking about going against veganism because it's killing children going to jail for murder? No. It's your fellow vegans going to jail for murder. What don't you understand? Man, you vegans are dense. It just proves, it just proves that you, you vegans are mentally unstable. You are unstable. Your, your view, your, your fantasy that you got going on in your head about veganism isn't what's in reality. This is reality right in front of your face. This is reality right in front of your face. All these people's testimonies is reality. And then you got people, oh, veganism destroyed my health. And you got idiots like Happy Healthy Vegan who don't have any credentials in nutrition, medicine, or anything commenting on people, what would actually happen to them. You, you know something? There has to be some kind of legislation passed that you put your child on the vegan diet. You need, immediately should be locked up. Because the doctors are telling you, and the results are in, the CDC has come in and, and said that vegan diet is a road to malnutrition because they keep seeing too many vegan kids come in and have to be revived in the ICU because of your stupid vegan diet. You're spreading misinformation and it's killing people. You should suffer the consequences for that. And on that, I'm out of here.